Now it's time for the Intrepid to get its cold start for the day. It's got the engine that everybody refers to as the dreaded 2.7, but this one actually runs really well. Check engine's just the battery. It needs a new one eventually. Put a new power steering pump in it. As the old one, the plastic could like melted or whatever, got brittle. And I went to tighten the line because it was leaking and it broke right off. Hundred seventy nine thousand five hundred forty miles. Damn headphones fell out. <coughs> New power steering pump. To replace the power steering pump, I had to pull the headlights, the front bumper radiator, just about everything off the front end, and if you can see it, I don't know how well this camera will show, there's a little piece missing out of the serpentine belt, so eventually we'll need one. Change the oil like, I don't know, every 30 miles just to make sure the engine was clean from sludge. Two point sevens are really good motors as long as you know how to take care of them. Just have to be easy with them. You can't always be redlining the shit out of them and doing friggin' races. As long as you take good care of it and always get the oil change, it's always a good car. This engine actually had a full top end rebuild when I bought it. It needed head gaskets. And the, it has a, had a carbon fiber water pump, which is kind of a piece of shit water pump, if you ask me. Now it has a steel bladed one. Heads were replaned, new head gaskets were put in. This here was busted, which is the air bleed for the um, coolant system. It had a friggin' piece of. Uh, Aluminum, I mean, yeah, aluminum foil, and a goddamn hose clamp on it. 
and that was replaced. Um, this motor has been a good motor. It's had a lot done. Never let you down, too. As long as you take care of them. Yeah, and that's one of the things that was ha what happened in the last few months. My dad recently passed away. And that's why I have the card on the rearview mirror. Great sound system too. <laughs> 